Now, when it comes to cognitive brain training, many people think about like learning like a new subject or a language, think about being in a classroom, but it doesn't have to be that. Now, I use the Fit Like training system to do my cognitive training. You follow it with Mind Body One stuff, you'll see how we do it with athletes, students, elderly, addiction populations. It's endless. Like I always say, if you have a brain, then you can be trained. So basically, the science of neuroplasticity means the brain can develop and change and become different. Now, we always thought back in the past that once you have it, that's it. Neurons die, they go away, and they just deteriorate. But now we know we can build them up. Now, Fit Like Training gives us an amplitude of ways to do that. Now, one drill I like to use is the plank light drill. Now, when it comes to cognitive brain training, many people think about like learning like a new subject or a language, think about being in a classroom, but it doesn't have to be that. Now, I use the Fit Like Training system to do my cognitive training. You follow it with Mind Body One stuff, you'll see how we do it with athletes, students, elderly, addiction populations. It's endless. Like I always say, if you have a brain, then you can be trained. So basically, the science of neuroplasticity means the brain can develop and change and become different. Now, we always thought back in the past that once you have it, that's it. Neurons die, they go away, and they just deteriorate. But now we know we can build them up. Now, Fit Like Training gives us an amplitude of ways to do that. Now, one drill I like to use is the plank light drill. Now, you know most writers incorporate some kind of decision-making, processing, working memory, attentional focus, but always is coupled with some kind of physical task. In this case, you're doing a plank. Now, while holding the plank, a lot of things are gonna be going on. Now, first, light activates. Now, there's three different lights about a foot apart. Now, under each light, there's two cars flipped over. Now, each car could be red, yellow, green, or blue. Same thing with the lights. So when the light activates, say red, and you flip the card over of your choice, any of the six, and if it's the same color of the light that's activated, you're gonna use your left hand to decide to use that to deactivate the light. Now, if it doesn't match the color that's activated, you're gonna use your right hand. So for example, if the red light comes on, I flip the card over, and it's red, I'm using the left hand. But if it comes on and it's blue, and I flip over a red card, I'm using my right hand. So I can be quick to make these maneuvers using fine motor skills and dexterity to move the card over, but also quickly process the information as quick as possible to make the physical movement to put the light out. Now, a lot's going on here, so you gotta carry out the instructions and make the decisions. Now, this is just one of many drills that I have for you to work on cognitive function using the Fit Light system. Now, just remember, get your mind right, see the light.